Hey, 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 Superior Shave fans and other humans, how are we doing today? Uh, what is today? 29 of January 2017. I have on my table here some Ed Radur. Uh, this is the 10 year old standard uh, core range version of it. Uh, uh, now I notice that it says um, uh, Scotland's Little Gem. Scotland's Little Gem. It used to say Scotland's smallest distillery. I don't know if that referred to uh, volume of spirit they produced or the size of the stills. Uh, in either event, it's a pretty small company, um, but not the smallest. And uh, I've gotten to like the Edredor. Uh, I have, uh, this is the fifth bottle of Edredor in some form that I've had for the past year. Uh, they have their heavily peated version, which is called Balikin, and that is the best of them to me that I have tried. But um, this one, it has quite a distinct uh, distillery character. There is a nuttiness to this whiskey that's uh, unique in the Scotch whiskeys that I've tried, like um, like candied nuts or something. But it, it's it's not necessarily sweet. Mm. Yeah, nutty is a better description. Uh, this one being the 40% version, I wouldn't buy it again. Um, I, I do like this distillery a lot, uh, but uh, in prior versions, I bought the signatory labeled Edward Dower. Uh, I think that's the company that uh, the man who owns Edward Dower owns signatory or something like that. But um, when you get the signatory version, the ABV is higher and they even have a straight from the cask version. And um, I find that at 40%, as often would be the case, uh, there's just not enough of the distillery character there. It's, it's missing that punch. And at, at 43 and high, really 46, uh, you can really taste that wonderful nutty character of this fine whiskey. But enough about my scotch habit. What I really came here to do today is to ask you if you would do me the honor of allowing me to pitch you this little focus nail file. That's right, this is a nail file coming in this cutesy little box from our friends at Focus in Milan. Uh, this is called the Focus L36 and you can see a little point of purchase display about it. This is quite a unique nail file. Can we get a look at that? It has uh, two concave sides. It is made of stainless steel, 316 stainless steel, which is a very rust resistant stainless steel. And it has a concave side here and a concave side here with little concentric circles. Uh, one of them is coarse, one of them is fine. Uh, along the outer boundary here, uh, it's ridged so you can go like this. Mm -hmm -hmm. You can clean under the nail and sand under the nail and get the, the, the tip of the nail thinner. And then you just put it inside the little thingamajigger here and you just go like this and it's very pleasant. So you got the coarser side, you got the finer side, and you just make these little concentric circles all the way around. This thing works fantastic and it's very small. Uh, you know, if you're buying it as a gift, you have to, you, you get this cute little gift box so you can uh, do the shtick I just did for your wife, girlfriend, boyfriend, significant other. I hope that they laugh. Uh, this outer band is just ridged so you can hold on to it really well. But there's one final feature I wanted to show you. That is this little flat part here. Can we see that? So that little flat facet and this little tangent chopped off of the nail file is so you can go like uh, this here. So we try to do all the moves and get up. And let's see if we can make it look a little easier here. All right, I'm going to do it like this here. All right, and we're rolling. And we're doing like that. So that's that move. And then you have the coarse and the fine. You stick the nail in there. You make the little circles. And then you flip it over and you make the little circles. You just go round and round, little happy circles. That's what we're doing. That's right. Little happy so it's clean underneath that nail, that dirty ass nail you got going there. Oh yes, that's good. Oh, oh, that's so much fun. Oh, too enjoyable. 
two enjoyable people. And we have this here. And we're going to go over here, and this one looks like it has a little bit of a corner thingy going there, so I'm going to grind his ass down a little bit there. That's right, there you go. You're just going to get ground down. And then we're doing like this here, and we're doing like this, and we're going to go under that one and get the under nail. You know what? I think you get the idea. Hey, uh, it's a wonderful nail file. It's expensive. Uh, it's uh, almost $40, but it's really well made and will last a lifetime. And it makes a very classy gift, and you can take it on all of your journeys uh, and just stuff it in the little baby pocket that's the papoose pocket on your jeans, like I've been doing for a week since I got it. And um, I'm sure you'll love it as much as I do. Well, that's all for today. Uh, I may not see you, you viewers again until 2018, so if I don't see you until then, have a happy new year. Um, drink scotch whiskey, and uh, please uh, don't drink and drive. Always be safe, okay? See you next time. Bye-bye.